Hello, my name is Marisa and I'm a travel blogger currently based in Aberdeen, Scotland. In this video, I'll be sharing with you my experience at Aberdeen Restaurant Week. So basically, businesses across the city are offering set menu deals such as two course lunch for £10, three course dinners for £20 and some places are offering afternoon tea and tasting menus. So I'm vegan so I'm going to show you what I ate but I'm also going to show you what my friends ate that aren't vegan. Before we start I just want to quickly mention that I am collaborating with Aberdeen Inspired as a restaurant week ambassador and they did pay for one of my meals. However all the opinions in this video are my own and they didn't actually ask me to make this video at all. The first place we went to was the Pinehurst Lodge Hotel. So it's located in Dice near Aberdeen Airport. So I went with my friend Stuart who is celiac and therefore can't have gluten. It's very important that there's no cross-contamination either. So when we arrived at the restaurant we immediately felt very welcomed and they brought us all with the menus with each dish clearly marked with different allergens. We both started off with a lentil soup which came with gluten-free bread and vegan butter and it was so good. <laughs> Then I had the vegan sesame and maple tofu which came with chips and a salad and Stuart had the same but with chicken instead. For dessert I got the strawberry gelato and Stuart got the tablet sundae which looked amazing. Uh, we were so full in the end. It was such a cosy place and they even had a whiskey land with over a hundred Scottish malt whiskies and the staff were so polite and friendly. The next place I went to was Cup, which is located just off Belmont Street, right in the city centre. And I went there for lunch with a friend and I had the vegan burrito with vegan haggis, vegan cheese, avocado and hot sauce. And it came with an amazing side salad. And for a drink I had their caramel nougat tea. My friend had the veggie burrito with egg, tomato, avocado and cheese and a chai latte. I just love their decor inside, it's just so nice and I can't get over how good the burrito was. Everything tasted amazing and the service was great. Next we tried out Books and Beans which is located on Belmont Street and it's a coffee shop that also sells books. My friend and I had the butternut squash and cherry tomato soup and I had the vegan sandwich with hummus and vegetables and a strawberry herbal tea. And my friend had a BLT with an egg on it and a coke. Thank you so much for watching and make sure you check out Aberdeen Inspires website for more future events and also just to see more about Aberdeen Restaurant Week and also I will post below some of the other bloggers reviews. Bye.